Hello everyone, Stars RJ here, so I tip the scales with another game of Mass Effect 2. Let's get started then on our next set of objectives. I might go to Ilium or I might just go help out Tali with her problem. Or I could go to the Krogan DMZ. Or I could get myself started on the um on the rest on on um that one. So many choices. Well, let's try the Krogan DMZ for a second. Well, let's get some stuff done over here. There's Tuchanka. I'm gonna buy some probes. Check, planet, check some of these planets out. Nope, we're not going. We're not actually going to those planets. We're just check. We're just looking. We're just browsing. Just browsing. Customer service and all that. No, 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 just looking. Okay, go to Tuchanka. I could land, but yeah, Tuchanka is like another hub. You can actually buy a whole bunch of stuff there. But not quite needed yet. Krogan DMZ to Drenek, then. Then to Nith. Nith! Of course, Ruffler doesn't tell me anything about it, even though Ruffler looks awesome with several moons. Alright, and this one, there's one over there. The door. Let's check this one out, it's... Oh, uh, Staz Goth, a very tiny gas giant. I don't think you can get a gas giant that tiny. Ooh, it's a big star. Nope, Tula. It's Tula. Uh, what's over here? What's over here? Alright, there's another gas giant. Actually, maybe there aren't any anomalies in gas giants. I thought there was. Alright, a Manson has nothing. Okay then, well, never mind. Let's go to Tuchanka. Let's go down to Tuchanka. Only half our fuel remains. Yeah, one well, of the main reasons I actually am I am delaying this whole going to Ilium thing is because, well, it's Ilium. A lot of stuff happens on Ilium and then Yeah, a lot of stuff can happen on Ilium and then spreads out elsewhere. But right now, right now only Miranda only Miranda really needs to go there. So let's bring let's bring both oh cycle appearance. There you go. Bring both Morden and Grunt down. Morden. I'm gonna I'm gonna save your skill points up for neural shock when you get it. And I think you you need your incendiary ammo. Let's see, yep. Yep. Let's go! Can't land the ship, it's too chunk up, you can land the shuttle. You were from the war zone. Well, let's have a look, see. Two to Chunka. And look, got an over captain. Mm. Watch it, human. Hey. Stop right there, alien. You're Shepherd of the Normandy. Hmm, yes. I don't like you. Got a problem? The clan leader wants to speak with you. Okay. Keep your running pet on a short leash. Get him the right soon or put him down. Right? What? Do you know what's wrong with him? What he needs? There's nothing wrong with him. Just go speak to the clan leader. I see. He seems to know. Straight away. Just looks at, look at Grunt and goes, yep. If you're looking for work, you're shouting down the wrong hole. The blood pack only recruits Krogan. And Vorcha. Of course, you don't want to do that. Take your business to the clan leader. Yeah, yeah, no, just let me buy. I have business. Alright, whatever, let's go. Through the door. 
Someday you will get off this rock and show those Turians who's boss. Damn right. Tear their scales off and let the Pijak's beast on the mother still alive. Ah. Yeah, that'll that'll help. That'll help a lot. Erdnot clan reports use weak encryption. I see references to a captured Solarian in the logs of the Chief Scout. Good. Talk to Scout then. Or Chief. Either one acceptable. Also, I have been unable to access local medical records. Of course. I suggest asking the local clan leader for assistance with Grunt's problem. Of course, Krogan. Krogan will like that. Here we are. On to Chanka. This you dump. When the female camps and the children over last week. No. I was off dealing with a Varen attack. What? Any promising warriors? No. Yes, of course. Strong. One day they will tear our enemies apart. Uh. Okay, something's going on here. You don't want anything I sell, human. It'll tear your insides like you swallowed knives. Hello. Uh, pet the Varen. Good Varen. Oh, it likes me. Stay. It uh. likes me. Uh. No, I don't want to talk to the Varen. Stay. I want to talk to Ratch over here. Greetings, human. My name is Ratch. Have a look at what no I've got. No hate for an alien? Everyone I talk to hates that aliens are an Erdnot. Except you. Mm. I don't have the luxury of turning away paying customers. I see. I do enough business off-world to know that you aliens have more credits than people so here what do you do. sell here, then? What do you have in stock? Most of it's food and drink that's toxic to humans. Ring calls a local favorite. Don't try to act tough, it'll tear your insides apart. Oh, it's yeah. not joking. Ring call hits aliens like ground glass. Otherwise, I've got weapons, scrap, and whatever food those pie jocks don't steal, which isn't much. Take a look at my kiosk over there if you want to buy something. Wait, pie jack? What the hell is a pie jack? Off world vermin. Humans say they're like monkeys. They come in and steal food, ring call, whatever they can get their talons on. Yikes. We started using the mounted defense cannons to stop them. Right, they're from not Why from here? Why do call the Pijaks off-world vermin? An alien trader landed here a few years back. He had goods he salvaged from some place called Elatania. I think I went there in so Mass Effect 1. they stowaways. They swarmed off a ship and started stealing food and shitting everywhere. And I guess he got hmm. killed. I can't imagine you let him walk away after that. Nope. Not a chance. One Thanks. ball of pie jock dung nailed the leader of Clan Four Santa across the forehead. Ouch. <laughs> That's apparently grounds for execution. Well, that'll be I'm a good shot. Maybe I can help out with the pie jacks. Hmm. Feel free. You can use the console out there to control the guns. Make a dent in the pie jock population, and you get a discount. All right. Tower defense. Good luck with that. I should go. Suit yourself. Yeah, so Ratch sells a whole bunch of stuff. I could do something about that, but you know, costs it costs a lot of money to do all that. Death mask, reach negotiation bonus by ten percent. Stabilization gauntlets. Yeah, I'm not too much interested in the art and that and all that. So, well, oh. from the right. Yeah, my eyes, I think. Oh, come on. Think you actually had a fertile female on one of your trips to their camp? Oh. I... I must have. Yeah, Son. right. Good for you. We'll get a ring call to celebrate. Yeah, actually, you can drink ring call. What happens is you go to, um, the alien... You go to the bar in the Citadel and ask for some alcohol. That special they had on the extranet? That crap rots your brain. You should be out hunting. Or fixing something if you can't hunt. It was a special bit on the Citadel. Yeah. But yeah, the um thing is that you can actually talk to um like you can drink ring coal. I've drinking enough of the alcohol in on the citadel, you then get the ring coal. This is the great Krogan homeworld. This is the land of Kredok, Shiagar, and Viol. This chunk of rock is barely worth standing on. Never thought I'd miss the tank. Hmm. You can also watch pit fight going on. Put down some real money. Uh, no bet, we've got a pit fight going on. Two of these Varen will go, Rawr! A little 
three for little instance, and then suddenly. One of them wins. Watch it, human. There's also a sign there's also some people up here. Don't touch anything. Hello, mechanic, how's it going? Don't look like I have time to talk. I've got work to do. Those fools brought this Tomka back from a skirmish without its combustion manifold. They say it got shot off in the field. Hmm. You tell me, how can you expect a Tomka to run without a combustion manifold? We're gonna find a manifold. Any idea where I could find a combustion manifold? Yeah, I can make one. Give me three days and a barrel of ring call. <laughs> the one they lost is probably still out in the field. It's too much to expect them to collect it and bring the damn thing back. Uh, so who are you anyway? I've never seen a Krogan mechanic before. What? You think we kidnap quarians and make them do the hard work? Not anymore, we don't. <laughs> I'm going out into the field. If I see a combustion manifold, I'll bring it back with me. If you did, it would save me a lot of work. Maybe bring back my sunny disposition. Aww. Let me get out of your way. Don't do me any favors. I think he's voiced by Worf. <laughs> I think all Krogan are. Krogan's hit by genophage. Nuclear assaults. Civil wars. Still survive. Yeah, no thanks to you. Or anyone else. Impressive to see life adapt. Continue despite circumstances. Inspiring. Hmm. Oh, you can punch. There's also a pie jack over here. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, you can just punch a pie jack. Can you do it Could once you again? Be in here? You can also look at the database. Yeah, I want to look into these. But they're expensive. Who are you? I am Fortak, Lord High Researcher in Matters Scientific for Clan Erdman. Yeah, hey, Krogan Scientist. I don't have time to answer your name. I don't bother you for long. I won't take up much of your valuable time. My work is very important, human. Of course it is. I'm just curious. I'd heard a lot about the genius of Krogan science. You have? Oh, finally, someone understands. I swear, I am among brainless piejacks here, toiling among satins. <laughs> I am the Lord High Researcher. What are you researching? You must be working on something important. I was building the biggest, best offensive ordnance yet. A real ground pounder. Hmm. But the new clan leader wastes my time with frivolous research. Crop genetics, medicinal improvements. We can buy that stuff from the Salarians. <laughs> Salarians created genophage, I've heard. Still trust them with medicines and agriculture? Yeah, yeah. What else can the Salarians do to us at this point? It's not like they can make us even more infertile. Well. Actually, wait, forget I said anything. <laughs> I take it you're a scientist. Yeah. I used to be a scientist. I designed weapons. Now my genius is wasted on frivolous things. <laughs> things that don't explode. My predecessor said no one would understand the true worth of my work. As I pulled my blade from his chest, I knew he was telling the truth. <laughs> not exactly what I would call effective academic peer review. What? <laughs> I don't care what you'd call it. We value the will to use what we create, not just the ability to create it. We don't count success until the ground shakes in response. I see. Enjoy your research. Yes, yes, move along. So you can get, I think you can get a discount with, um, Vortac. These things would last now, longer if, if Rex was not alive, clear. he'd be, um, he'd be working ahead. weapons, he'd be very, very like, Yeah, I'm working on weapons! Yeah! Ha ha! Weapons! Yes! Right. Let's see what the human can do. Do 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 do. All right. So, how to shot web? Oh no! Wait. Nope. How to shot web? How do I shot web? Oh, it's that button. That button shots web. E. E shot web. Oh, I think you have a limited missile supply. Oh, so there's little icons at the side there telling you, telling you um, how far you are from, like which which, which side of the field the gun's going to fire from. Important to know in case you're hitting tires. All right, and another one. Go. Wave done. Task complete. Doo -doo -doo. Doot, doot, doot. 
No? Alright. Fire! Firing all missiles! Going! I am going! Firing! Firing all missiles! Don't waste the missile, too many missiles. Firing! Nope, see, don't fire too many missiles. So I'll hit, hit a tire instead. If you can get two for one, that's a great, that's a great idea. And one more. Bam! Kablamski. Wave beginning. Fight! Mortal Kombat! Dun 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 Mortal Kombat! Firing missiles! I'm going! Yeah, the AoE is not as impressive on this thing. Here we go. Next. Next! Firelink missile. No, 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 no. Don't get... You're not getting anywhere. Alright, we're done. Quest complete. And yeah, you can do the rest for fun if you want. Give me a reason. Yeah, you can... Yeah, continue the fight if you want, but it's... Probably you didn't want to. My son. <laughs> Played tackle the Baron. It was, it was good, fast, strong. Well, of course he was. Any son of yours must be. Then they went back to the female camp. It was so fast. Aww. I didn't get to talk with him. Aww, poor guy. Where's the poor guy? I lost half my stock in a bed on the pits. It was the good half. Hmm. Seeing those vermin roasting in the heat from an explosive shell. No, I swear it was My gorgeous. pleasure. It was a lot of fun. Help yourself to more. There's no shortage of pie jocks out there if you get a craving for violence. I'll give you a discount at my store. Anything you want. You buy it All right. I should go. Suit yourself. Alrighty then, now I can buy a pie jack meat. Okay, now I can buy this the heavy weapon upgrade. Stabilization gauntlets, even though I'm not going to use any of these. I got the Kestrel armor. Yeah, I got, I got the Kestrel armor. And now I can talk to Urz over here. And now I can feed him. Here, try this. And then he's now my friend. Huh. Looks like Urz finally found someone to follow around. And there you have it. You now have Urz, the the Should pit I ask fighter. The male clan for okay. right of parentage. Why bother with all the politics? You know you've sired a son. That's enough. But I could teach him to hunt. Uh, the best way to shoot a gun. To fight with honor and savagery. Eh, you can do that next time they bring the children home. It's not the same. Hmm. <laughs> Poor guy. But yes, the pie jack meat. So now I can I can now pit the so you can put down, make a bet for us, a Baron that was a former champion pit fighter. I think you get one free. You, yeah, I think you get one battle out of this. Or I think you get one or two battles from him, then you bet against him because you're gonna get injured the next time. Yeah, then you get, then you get, then he gets injured and you have to do it again. So bet twice for him, then bet against him. You do that constantly, and Urz takes a while to recover. Hold. You must wait till the clan leader summons you. He is... in talks. You know what tradition demands. Clan mm. Erdnot must respond. Your reforms will not go unopposed. You risk appearing weak at a critical time, Shepard. Hello. Good enough. Rex. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> How do I... Shepard. My friend. <laughs> Aww. You look well for dead, Shepard. Should have known the void couldn't hold you. <laughs> Looks yeah. like helping me destroy Saren and the Geth has worked out for you. Glad we didn't have to kill each other on Vermeer. 
<laughs> you made the rise of Erd not possible. Vermeer was a turning point for the Krogan, though not everyone was happy about it. Uh -huh. Destroying Saren's genophage cure freed us from his manipulation. I used that to spur the clans to unify under Erdnot. I see. You abandoned many traditions to get your way. Dangerous. Oh, shut up, you. <laughs> spoken to no, dogs and like, Varen's in the way. Like your clan to glory, whether it likes it or not. <laughs> yeah, biotic oh, headbutt, sure. I guess. What brings you here? How's the Normandy? It blew up. Destroyed in the collector surprise attack. I ended up spaced. Oh. Well, you look good. Ah, the benefits of a redundant nervous system. Yeah, humans don't have that. Oh, it must have been painful then. But you're standing <laughs> here, and you've got a strong new ship. Takes me back to the old days. Us against the unknown. Killing it with big guns. Good times. Tell me about your work. Sounds like you've got big changes ahead for the Krogan. We are making a neutral ground where all clans are welcome. Further nice. emails can be shared among clans. We will strengthen the race as a whole. Nice. You threaten everything that makes us strong. It will not last. Maybe. Until then, you're lucky to be a part of it. How do you control then? How do you maintain security with so many different clans in one place? Any clan willing to send in hostages can come in. No fighting inside the camp. Each clan punishes its own criminals. I see. We stop conflicts before anyone dies. Then we present a simple choice. Pay a fine and deal with your problems, or your clan is no longer welcome. Seems reasonable. That doesn't sound very harsh by Krogan standards. Allies from other clans like what I'm doing. They help deal with skeptics. Many are eager for an outlet. Mm -hmm. Every time I've declared a clan unwelcome, my allies have destroyed them. Word gets around. Nice. What's so important about maintaining individual clans? Every clan has different customs, rites of passage, rules of behavior, battle songs, all unique. That diversity makes us great. No clan, not even mine, was meant to survive on its own. Most dominant. Erdnot is the leading clan. Doesn't that make your culture primary? For now. But every clan has its unique assets. The best tacticians are Erdnot. Chorgal has the longest breeding line. Gadatog holds the oldest settlement. Others have their own strengths. Nice. We keep going how we are. The clans will end up as craters under nuclear haze. Even Erdnot. We need to rethink. Restart. Nice. I hope that works well for your people. But back to the reason I'm here. We don't often allow aliens to do business on Tuchunka, but you're an exception. So, Salarian and Blood Pack. I'm looking for a Salarian. He was captured by the Blood Pack and brought here. Nope. My scout commander can direct you. He's probably near the perimeter running target practice. I see. Don't take too much of his time. I need a constant watch on the other clans. So what's wrong with Grunt? I have a Krogan on my crew. He has some kind of sickness and needs treatment. Uh. Let's have a look at him. Where are you from, Welp? Was your clan destroyed before you could learn what is expected of you? I have no clan. I was tank bred by Warlord Okir. My line distilled from Kredok, Moro, Shiagar. You recite warlords. But you are the offspring of a syringe. Oh dear. I am pure Krogan. You should be in awe. Okir is a very old name. A very hated name. Oh dear. He is dead. Of course. You're the <laughs> shepherd. How could he be alive? Does it change anything? Does that name mean anything to you, Rex? A vicious warlord responsible for many deaths. Who apparently toyed with genetics. A clone undertaking the right? You what? are considering it? Tank bred allowed status as an adult? This is too far. Quick, head bottom, There's Shepard. Nothing wrong with him. He's becoming a full adult. What? Ah, puberty ritual. Common among species with hormone driven reproductive urges. I don't care what aliens call it. <laughs> Krogan undergo the rite of passage. Too far, Rex. Your clan may rule, but this thing is not Krogan. Headbutt. 
idiot. So, Grunt, <laughs> do you wish to stand with Erdnot? That's what's involved. What does the rite of passage require? Not for me to say, Shepard. The shaman will discuss that. You'll let a tank red Krogan join Clan Erdnot? Yeah, it's Krogan. Only because he's with you. After all, you and I killed thousands like him. Not quite as big, but many. Indeed. Clan Erdnot is strong, and the others will do as I say. They see the benefit of my vision. What if he doesn't want to join? What happens if he doesn't do this rite of passage? If he was left here, he would be killed. The clanless are not respected. A tank bred, probably see. more so. His disposition is what it is, right or no. That's just him being a Krogan. Okir didn't tell you that in the tank. Did he, boy? Your call. Your call, Grunt. This is his choice. Mm-hmm. You take the right. It is in my blood. It is what I am for. Good boy. Speak with the shaman. He's over on the second level. Give him a good show and he'll set you on the path. I see. You too, Shepard. How many times have you stepped in a mess for your crew, hmm? Hmm. <laughs> Well, this is gonna be interesting. Uh, I'm good to see you, Rex. Sure, you can't come with us? Nope. Wish I could, but I need to keep these short-sighted fools in line. Hunt well, Shepard. Indeed. So, looks like we've got a whole bunch of stuff waiting for us up ahead. We have to bring Grunt to a rite of passage, and we also have to bring um, yeah, we bring Grunt to a rite of passage, and. We've still got to find. We've still got to find the uh, Salarians. Still got to find that Salarian dude. So the yeah. The Presidium has a big statue of a Krogan right in the middle. <laughs> well, I'm not putting a damn Asari statue up here. If that's what you want. Don't be a fool. They were honoring our fight against the Ratna. Maybe they could have honored us by not bombing us with the Jedi Phage. Oh jeez. Ugh. Sweet and sour grape or something. Millions of people live there. Why do you care so much? You gonna leave the chunker? Run off with the damn blood pack mercs? No. no. Then shut up and quit yammering about what you'll never see. So, anyway. I'll tear you apart. You don't have the plates to try. Alright, so they're fighting. Anyway. So, I'm gonna take Grunt for his ride of passage and make him become a man. But that'll be for another video. I'm Sazar J, and I'm going to tip the scales in the favour of the Krogan. Signing off!